Okay guys, so some of you have asked questions about your apps are not appearing on the Sky Q. Now, um, if you had a new install, this may be possible when you go to the app section, the apps don't appear. So let me show you how to get your apps up. This should fix a problem. So you've got your Sky remote. Your remote obviously may look different depending on what remote you have. All the Sky Q remotes do exactly the same. So what you wanna do is scroll down from the main screen and go to settings, okay? Pause there for a second. Don't press the middle select button. Then what you wanna do on the remote control, press zero, zero, one, and select. This will bring you to a kind of like a secret menu. Right, now what you wanna do is go down to where it says apps. Now, can you see on the right hand side, it says refresh apps. So if you just scroll to the right, and then what you want to do, as soon as you're on it, it's hovering on it, you want to press select and refresh. It will say your apps are being refreshed. What that does is basically refreshes the software so it sends those apps back to your SkyQ box. Now, sometimes it appears back straight away, sometimes it may take a few minutes. What you want to do, just press it a couple of times, refresh, refresh, refresh. There's not a certain number of times. Then what you want to do is press the home button then go back to where you see where it says apps. You should be able to see your apps there now, right? So sometimes one may appear, two may appear. If you see like, for example, one or two appear, that's good because they'll come down slowly. And then you go to the right, you'll see all your apps come up. Your apps may look slightly different than mine and uh, depending on sort of what subscription you got, but usually you have all the same. So you've got the Boosty iPlayer, Netflix, YouTube Kids, Disney Plus, YouTube, and Spotify. Sky have released some new stuff like games, music, and stuff, entertainment, sort of like categorizing it. Let me know in the comment section if that's worked. Hope you guys have found this video useful.